Hi there, it's Carrie from getanorwexwebsite.com. I wanted to show you how to put the Norwex monthly specials on your website. These need to be changed once a month on the first of the month so that your specials are current and when people buy them from you, they are buying the current special and you're not having to uh, give a discount on things that actually are not on sale with Norwex. Okay, so on your website, I'm on the Canadian demo site just to show you here, but on your website, you have a category in your categories of products called monthly specials. Also on your website there's a little box that shows one of the specials and this rotates randomly. Uh, if you click the, the more button it'll take you to the whole kit and caboodle. I'll go back. Uh, also it's set up on your website that the specials will show at the bottom of your home page. Okay, because when people come to your site they want to read the information that you have but they also want to see what's on sale, right? Okay, so now you need to know how to change those and it is a two-step process. So I'm going to show you one step at a time. I've already logged into the back end of this demo Canada website. I'm going to just click the other window I have open here and now I'm in the back end of the site. Okay, if you are in the back end and you go up to the top green bar where it says catalog, click on categories slash products. That will bring you to a screen that shows you all of the categories that you have right now on your website and the one that you care about is the one that says monthly specials. Okay, If we click that one open just by clicking our mouse we can see that this one is set up to show the December specials. Okay, So say it's January and you want to add a new special. Okay, You would click new product and a screen will come up that asks for quite a bit of information here and you need to put the information in for this new product. So you will get the information from the products. First of all they come in an email from Norwex so you'll have them there but if you are to check on the uh, demo site for your country we will have the specials already inputted there for you just around the last week of the month so that you can go in and take the picture out and use it for your own website and so that you can um, just copy the text and paste it in. Okay, but let's just put in a, a test special here. Okay, so I'm going to call it test special. Uh, leave these buttons alone. When you get to the tax class, if you're in Canada or the United States, you need to choose the uh, the tax class. I'm in the Canadian site, so I've got the GST uh, PST site. You can see if you look in any of the products on your website you'll be able to see what tax class to use. In Australia you don't use any tax class. Okay, um, The product price you put in say that this package is $59.99. It puts in a gross price for you. Just ignore that. That's okay. Okay, uh, You skip down, skip down, skip down, skip down. In the in the product description box you would put in uh, whatever you want to say about this product. Usually you make a little bulleted list. So you write um, this package includes and then um, you make a list one um, in viral cloth. Again this information will be available for you to copy from any of the demo sites. The demo site for your country. But I'll just show you how to do it assuming that you didn't have that information. So say this is your package, an enviro cloth and a window cloth. The product's quantity box, if you leave it at zero or leave it empty, that product does not show up on your site. So I just default always to 10,000. Okay, You can put in a model if you want to. That, that's like a product number. So in the catalog every product has a number, but specials don't. So you can leave it blank or uh, you can put in, you can make up your own if you want to. Um, the image that you use for the product is you can take it right off of the demo site for your country. So once you've got that on your computer you click browse and you you find that um, picture on your computer. I'm just going to do a hunt here for a picture. Um, say this is my picture here. So I'm going to say that's my picture and I don't need to worry about anything else on this whole page. I'm just going to click preview and it, it has the information that I want so I can click insert. Okay, so now that test special, there it is. It shows up in my monthly specials but you can see that it is not on sale. Okay, so part two of this uh, process is putting this product that you've made on sale. Okay, and here's how to do that.
to put a product on special, to actually put it on a sale, you go up to Catalog, uh, scroll down to Specials, give it a click, and wait for a minute. Okay, and you'll see all of the current specials are in here, okay? The, the special that we just made, the test special, is not in here yet. So we click New Product, and we have to find it, okay? So in here in this box, these are in alphabetical order. So we're going to scroll down all the way until we find Test Special. There it is. So I'm going to click it. And I am going to uh, give it a special price of, say it's on sale for $49.99, okay? Um, you give it, you can also put a percentage actually too, but Norwex is giving you a price to use, so you'd use the price. You put an availability date and an expiry date. So if this is a January special, I'm going to put it for December so you can see what it does here because we're still in December 2009 here. Um, you would say, okay, it's available December the 2nd and it expires on December 31st. Okay, so, so it will come off special, meaning that the, it will no longer be on sale on December 31st. Okay, sometimes Norwex will off offer a special that will extend for a second month. In that case, you would come back in here and you would uh, just extend the date on the special. So give it a, the extra month. Okay, so say it goes to, to January 31st. I insert it and then you can see here it is. It's on my list. It's on sale. So that's a pretty generous discount by Norwex standards. Um, and then if I am Looking on the front end of my site at my specials, which are down at the bottom of the page here, if I refresh, I've now put this test special, here it is, test special, on my site. The original price was $59, it's now on for $49, and if I click on it, I can see that I've typed in one Enviro cloth, one window cloth. So that's it, and anybody could buy it at that point, and, uh, and that's it. That's how you put a special on your site.